Hey, Dr. Cuomo back here with this Strauman case. We got the screw nice and loose now. Uh, we took the head of it off, so here we go. We're spinning it out slowly but surely. Uh, going in a counterclockwise rotation, staying away from any threads. So I'm well within the parameters of the of the abutment, and uh, it's a good day. Uh, you know, it, you got to have a microscope. I'll, I'll tell you that. Without a scope, you feel like you're abandoned. And now we're spinning out the screw. See the head? We just got the screw out. And uh, we're going to do the final cleaning of the threads. Once we do that, uh, we'll be in good shape. Using an endodontic explorer, a few more threads, and we'll use the micro suction tip just to pull that out of there. There's six threads to the end of this baby. Not six, maybe seven. I forgot what Strauman told me. Uh, but this one's just about out now. We did not have to pre-soak this one because it was a definitely coal weld in there. So the prior access and uh, let's keep going here. Okay, now we're ready to pick up the suction now. All right, let's hopefully it's not caught in there. We're going to use our 20 gauge suction. Hopefully they can get that out now. We're putting a throw pack in there for safety. And here we go. This is, uh, okay, get a hold of that. Now, same thing, I'm going to go in a counterclockwise rotation. Let's see, just hold this. Well, it's coming. No. Nope. So we're going to put some water down in there. And we'll just continue to spin it. Uh, I don't have to pre-soak this one with any kind of solution. Uh, but we're just going to continue to use an endodontic explorer. And uh, see if it comes quietly here. Come on now. Okay, comes another spin. Um, you know, it could be path holding this baby in there. Maybe just a little bit of the path. Um, let's see. Uh, at this point, that's a little, uh, little lip. It might be a path issue. All right, let's try to suction that out now. Perhaps a, sm a larger suction tip might be the answer here. A little more volume. Let's see. All right. Let's take and jump. Nope. Yeah. Okay, we're working. Almost there. Right. Something in there? You can see how tedious this is. This must be a lip holding this back, and I don't really don't want to grab any more filings. So let me just try to try to suction this out. Let me come quietly here. Need a little more volume on suction. Maybe maybe a larger tip, a pink maybe if we have any. Trying the kit in our kit. Otherwise, we'll get this one another day. How delicate it is, isn't it? Just spinning around. Maybe these screws are made to stay within the abutment. I didn't think of that. I checked the last abutment I used, but this is a titanium. I'm just wondering if it's made to stay in there. And if that's the case, uh, the next step is to get the whole abutment out, which we're going to try to do another day. We would have to just, oh, there it goes. Get it? Stay, stay, stay. We got it. Right no, there. Stay still. Okay, let me take a look at that. All right. Keep your glasses, keep your glasses on. Arlene, keep your glasses on. This is our screw. Come on, Chris. There we go. Keep your glasses on. 
And let's check to see if there's any bio burden inside that screw. There it goes. So we took the head of that screw off, and yes, there is a lot of blood in there, a lot of bio burden. That's the first thing I check for. So we got to go ahead and clean the threads out. Yes, thank you. All right. Clean out the threads. Let me put a little bit of, uh, let me go ahead and just suction out the metal filings. Ah. Uh, a lot going on here. Let's give her another bite Close box. Down. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Okay, uh, hang on. I need a small suction to yellow. Yeah, I'm going to put a red tip on this, please. Okay, so what I'm going to use now is tartar and stain. Just as a precautionary measure, we're going to use a brush so that I don't inject a lot of this material because it is a mild acid. Okay, here we go. Just a little on a brush. Just because there's so much metal flying around in here from prior access, we'll switch it back. Not even close on the length. So I'm going to go back in, put a drop. Okay, drops in. Now, microsuction, and, and hopefully uh, the lesson learned here is uh, we'll get a micro brush ready. Okay, so I'm way down inside working it. I'm just working it. And I'll show you what we have. See that brown? That's not quite all blood. That's just... Uh, there we go. I'll take another micro brush. We haven't gotten to the uh, abutment yet. Abutment's in there. But we're going after it another day. We're just going to try to facilitate possibly another screw if possible. But without just hand tightening. We'll put another basal screw in there. Here we go. Rinsing again. Okay, microsuction now. We'll look way down inside. Oh boy. All this is abutment. So we saved this one, but now we've got to we got to get our little new screw in there just temporarily. We're not going to over tighten anything, just enough, and uh, we'll find our little abutment now. Here it is, a new basal screw. pack and a strawman driver throw pack please I got the driver uh-huh throw pack please okay okay here we go we got our our screw right back in there And I'm just going to go gently down. If it fits in there, if it's not going in, I'm not going to do anything. We'll just leave it. I'm going to... No. It, it did drop in. Okay. So now I'm just gently really feeling for just first point of tightness. That's it. That's all I'm going to do, just so that nothing goes down into inside of this uh, abutment. Now our patient's going to be instructed not to really eat on this. All right. There's the new screw. Again, uh, let's look at that close up. 
All right, so it's not buried in there. I'm not tightening it down with anything. It's, it's just an, a screw that I'm going to place uh, to keep that uh, opening. Now I'm going to use this as a material called um, Extra Fast NDS from uh, uh, GC America. GC America, and it just sets very quickly. And we're just going to put some on the top of this, that's all. Let's put some. This is just a temporary. Uh, wipe that. Okay, we'll let that set. Take a micro brush. And this we can actually watch set before she leaves. And um, we might even put a little bonding on the edge just so that uh, it doesn't become a problem. We're going to wait for this to set though. Put it in the mailbox. All right, so again, this is Dr. Jerry Cuomo. Again, another rescue case successful, uh, but we'll give you part two, which is retrieval of the abutment. Take care for now. We'll see you next time.